Today is a very, 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 very important day. And I've got no idea if that was in focus. This camera's a little slow with the auto it, it wasn't. Are you kidding me? Focus, man. There. Sony. If anybody at Sony's watching, which I highly doubt, <laughs> you guys need to seriously fix the autofocus on this thing. This autofocus is brutal. This camera is whack. I like love the camera, but I hate it at the same time. You're gonna unbox an item that I thought I got scammed with. Turns out it just took a long time for me to get it. Inside of here, I hope, is a USB spy camera. But today we're gonna put it to the test, starting with unboxing. Apparently you're supposed to be able to plug this in the wall and there's a little hidden camera on it. Creepy. I try Trust me, I'm with you on creepiness of this product. Let's go ahead and open this up. Hi. Okay, new angle. I know, really lazy of me because I just technically moved the camera from there <laughs> to here. Oh, my hot chocolate. Oh, it's already done. In other news, I got a haircut yesterday, but like I'm wearing a hat because when you leave a hair salon and they like, do it all up, they blow dry it, it like never looks like that ever again. I'm trying to clean out my house, get rid of things I don't need, and I'm coming across gifts like this. It's a thermos that says, I love my dash, and if, if my mom who got me this, if you're watching, thanks for the gift. I just, I never use this stuff. On top of that, she got me these two years ago, but they, she got me these like candy trays that say, I love my dash, and I don't know, like I'm not 60 years old. What am I gonna keep little candies in here when people come over? Let's get an unboxing this. Ba, 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 ba. Wait, what the f whoa, 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 whoa. I'm very confused at this. Oh, that's good. Oh, that is so spy-y. Nothing on this box states that it's a camera. At the bottom, it says USB universal charger. On the back, it gives all the specs on how fast it can charge a phone. Oh, you're bad. This seriously, I'm very impressed. Oh, there is a camera, oh my God. What the f there is a camera. <gasps> Is that a speaker? Oh my God, that is tricky as hell. See the little dot above the USB charger? That's the camera. There's a little dot right here. I think that's the mic. This sticker right here is the only thing that is an indicator that it could be a camera because it says 32 gigs on it. By the way, it is negative 15 degrees outside, so I'm literally just hanging out at home all day. I can't do anything. Okay, and it comes with a charging cable. And very Asian instructions. We're about to test right now to see if this even charges a phone or if that's the only way that you can get out the video. If you got an open charger like this plugged in your wall, somebody will plug their phone in. If this is not legitimately charging your phone, that is a huge giveaway. All right, guys, this is my favorite outlet in the house. You guys have those too, right? <laughs> No, but actually, I love this outlet because it, it seems to charge my phone faster than every other one. Belly button height, the standard size. Here is the hidden camera size. So it's bigger all around, it's bulkier, but it's not crazy. So that doesn't look totally out of the ordinary. Here's my phone, not on. Ooh! Okay, so it legit charges. There's no buttons on this thing, so I'm not sure. Like, did it start already? Is it recording right now? It comes with this cord, which is USB to USB. But I think that's how you get the footage off. You plug this in here and this in your computer. Let's click video. Okay, so there's two video clips in here already. I guess we're gonna see the quality. Super slow, man. So it looks like it's me and my computer right now. Guys, this quality isn't bad. Look at that, the exposure is changing on this thing. Okay. So we're gonna go ahead and plug in the provided USB cable into there and the other end into my computer. This thing, I am so surprised by. The video quality looks like it's 1080p. The second you plug it into a wall outlet, it starts recording. 90% of plugs or outlets are at like ankle height. That could be a challenge. Let me show you guys what the intended purpose or how I think you're really supposed to use this thing. When the conversation comes up or when the evidence or whatever they wanna capture starts to come up, they plug in the USB charger. From the moment that it's plugged in, it will start recording for three minutes. So right now we're in my bedroom. Let's say I wanna capture something. This is pretty much like an audio only room, essentially. God, I am so, when did I become such a spy creep? An audio only room? <laughs> However, every single night I charge my phone on this like, looks like a extension cord from the 30s. I wonder if I plug this in, just like that. I wonder if this is actually gonna start recording and it's kind of like a little vlog camera. Um, this would be the only way that you'd be able to capture anything visual in a room that the plugs are all covered. Let's just say it's like right here. I wanna show you guys what you can capture. So I've duct taped a plug, an extension plug to the wall. And from there, I could get everything that happens in my room, like my bedroom. This is also good if you wanna make amateur porn. I've been a bad mailman. You could capture sleeping. Looks like someone's like slamming in my bed, you know what I mean? I knew I should not have eaten that burrito. Thank God there's no one in here watching. You know what I mean? 
Overall, this device is really good. There is a huge element of creepiness that comes along with it. Either way, I bought the item, I had to test it out. I honestly thought I was gonna get scanned by this. Oh, I just got a tweet. Guys, I need to talk about something with you guys right now. Today is an extremely important day. It's probably one of my favorite days of the year. Bell Let's Talk Day. For every single tweet, text message that uses the hashtag Bell Let's Talk, five cents will be donated to mental health initiatives. So if you're watching this today, the day of the upload, please take to Twitter and use the hashtag Bell Let's Talk. I will like every Bell Let's Talk tweet that you guys want to share on Twitter and you tag me in, no problem. This is a big day for me. I don't want to change the entire topic of this video. I'm somebody that absolutely has my moments and struggles with anxiety. A lot of these creative things are ways for me to get thoughts that are in my head out. These all have a very deep meaning as to what I was feeling in the moment. This one says Houston. It is a headset that NASA used back during that mission to the moon. Somebody calling for Houston, but nobody's there to listen. It was at a moment that I felt like there was nobody to talk to. I created this. This one, it says be happy. It's a bunch of hands pulling at the words be happy because in this time when I created this, I felt any time that I wanted to be happy, anytime something good came my way, there were people to come and pick it apart and say, eh, you know, th this is probably better. Eh, it's not that cool. Or, eh. This one right here was when I really needed some ass one night. <laughs> okay, this was the very first one I made. It says, well, I think I've gone mad. These are things that uh, I've dealt with inside my head. I want you guys to know watching right now, I know this video was supposed to be a fun spy camera thing, and it was. If you're watching this at home and you have felt extremely, an, an intense feeling of aloneness or sadness, you are absolutely not alone. Whatever you're going through, you can get through it. And I know it's a very tough thing for you to hear because I'm just a YouTuber, you don't connect with me maybe, but I promise you I've been there. I, pr I, I promise you people have been there. And whatever you're feeling, and as intense as it is, it's not forever. Your brain will sit there and say, man, it's forever. Don't listen to him, it's forever. It's gonna, it's been here for four years. It's gonna be here for 20 more. It won't, it won't. Anyways, guys, please use the hashtag Bell Let's Talk. That's all I gotta say. Let's get back to the video. I'm gonna be honest, it doesn't help that I didn't shower this morning because my hair looks like pubes. New, new cut, it's a little shorter on the sides, a little sleeker into the beard line. Final thoughts about this? It's pretty amazing. Um, in the least creepy way possible. I believe it's 1080p. It's very discreet. Here in the top corner of this thing, there's a little hidden light. When you plug it in, it's gonna blink three times to let you know that it's recording. Be careful because it blinks a bright red light that you need to watch out for. The charging port on this guy also doubles up as a data transfer to get the footage. I believe the mic is here in the back and I'm pretty impressed with it. All in all, I'd say this is a good purchase. Will it get used? No, I promise anybody that comes to my house, I will not record you visually or audio. I don't like that. I don't want people to be freaking paranoid around me anymore. So no, anymore. <laughs> It was never a thing. I just that slipped up. Anyways guys, thank you so much for watching If you guys want to see a cool animated photo of my breakfast tray go over to my Instagram at Danocracy Check it out. Give it a like give me a follow. I would really appreciate it I'll also be posting some behind the scenes of my interview tonight Thank you guys so much for watching be sure to hit that subscribe button on my channel turn notifications on so you guys get updated when I have a new video Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in my next video. See you guys later